Hi, hello. Today's question is one of the common interview question during your coding rounds. So they will give you one expression and they want to, they will ask you to validate is it balanced or not. Let's understand what is it. Now, if you look at, uh, this is one of the arithmetic expression where you have uh, brackets, braces, operators, operands, right? So now if you look into the structure, the placement of the brackets, operanders, it's balanced. For example, in case if we misplace this bracket here, it's not balanced, right? So this is what we need to do. To remove the complexity, we will remove operators, operands out of these expressions. Now, your input will look like this. All you need to do is the given input structure is balanced or not. For example, you have multiple samples. Uh, this structure looks like very balanced. So your output should print true. This structure does not look like balanced because if you notice here, the characters are misplaced. The braces are misplaced, right? So it should return false. So similarly, this particular input should return true because everything looks good, placed well. The last one is completely a misalignment. So this is the one thing. So it has to return false. So this is basically a stack data structure problem. Uh, but a uh, few interviews will ask you to implement using list. They don't want to use to use pop push related uh, related functions directly. So the logic here is you have to iterate each character in the given string and when you face any opening braces bracket or parentheses push the character on top of the string in case when you encounter any closing bracket parentheses or brace you need to take out one character from the top top of the stack and compare them are they the pair if they are the pair and uh, till the end if you continue the same process if there is no characters left out in the stack this is good in between any mismatch it's not a balanced expression so that's the output we are going to give here so let's implement I'm going to write one private method, which is going to be static. It takes input as a string, returns boolean, We are going to use list as a stack in this example. So list, it's going to be a character list. Now let's iterate through the input. We are going to get each character and iterate through it. Now, as discussed, if we get opening brackets or braces or parentheses, we need to push it to the array. If character double equal to bracket or character double equal to brace or character double equal to parentheses push it to the stack that is top of the stack here our list is uh, our stack is list so on the top we always try to push to zero index stack dot add at zero the character so else we need to write our comparison operator. Let's see what is the element at the top. Care 
TMP from stack stack dot get at index zero. Notice that we are not removing; we are just getting it for comparisons. So now we need to see that if we are getting closing bracket, it must match with opening bracket. That means we are checking: is it a pair? Is it making a pair or not? The top element of the stack and the current character in the iteration must be a pair. Then it is balanced as part of this iteration till now. In case if it is not matching, it's out of balance. If C double equal to closed one and temp from stack double equal to opened one right similarly let's compare other pairs also or this is closed brace and here open brace another pair this is closed parenthesis and here open parenthesis in this case what we do it's a balanced one we will pop out the top character that means we'll take out the top character stack dot remove at index 0 right in case if it is not it's not balanced you can stop the entire process return false So this is not balanced. We are closing it, right? So now, once the entire iterations are done, the for loop is over, we need to check, is the stack empty or not? If anything left over in the stack, that means it's not balanced. If everything, I mean, if it is empty, that means it's a balanced. If stack not is not empty return false otherwise by default it returns true now one more thing in between see it's like we are keep pushing anytime we are getting the closed one we have to get its pair right in that case what if the stack is empty that means the order mismatch balance is lost so that as part of this we need to check when the stack is empty it's not balanced because we need to pull one character So this is our code. Let's run its balanced expression. It's a static method. So the input will be we'll pick one from here. So which should return true. Let's print that. So now when we run this, the output is false. That means somewhere I did mistake. Let's check, add, remove, get, oh, okay. This must be open.
now let's run it's true let's uh, pass another input so this must return false now pass another input this should give true let's pass the final input this must be false yep so it has executed all the use cases thanks for watching this video please subscribe to the channel